welcome back. So as I mentioned in my Sunday Loves, I was going to redo my part two of the VIB sale because I had lipstick all over the face and I just did not get it. And I was so mad at myself for doing that, specifically because I use dark lips all the time and I never get it on my lips, on my teeth. And then the one time I use a very light color, it gets all over my, my, my teeth. So it drove me nuts. So I am redoing this video for you guys, so I hope I remember everything. It's ironic because this side of the haul is all about lippies. I did go um, lippy crazy. I never buy myself uh, lipsticks or any lip products when it comes to these types of sales or even in general. I tend to go towards three things, eyeshadow palettes, pigments, and highlighters. That's my thing. I absolutely love to buy stuff like that. I jump on it first thing um, that I can get it. So this time around I decided to um, go for lippy. So I only have three products that I didn't show you the first time that are not lip products. So I'm going to get to those first. First product that I did pick up was the Laura Mercier uh, Mineral Powder Warm Bronzer. I have heard um, Sarah from Print, Pol Print? Print Polish and Shine. Sarah from Print, Polish, and Shine has spoken about this, and she says she absolutely loves it. Miss Lola Lynn as well has spoken about it, and I wanted to give it a shot. So it's just a bronzer. I've never tried these before, and I really wanted to try it. So for the 20% off, I picked this up. I also picked up, and I could not help myself. I kept going back and forth and back and forth which one to pick up and I just couldn't decide so I just went ahead and got both of them specifically two because one of them was sold out before the sale and then I saw it come back during the VIB sale and I said jump on it girl because you need it that's how we do so what I'm talking about is the makeup forever compact shine on um, iridescent compact powder now this is supposed to be like one of those illuminating powders you put over your foundation. No, no, not for me. But I want to use these as a highlighter. So the first one that I picked up was the number three. So this is what they look like. They have a magnetic uh, like closure thing. And this is number three. This is like your beigey color. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my goodness, you guys. So soft and absolutely stunning. So that's number three i'm going to show you these because i need to show you these look at that number three isn't that a beautiful highlight oh i am in love you guys in love i had to get these and i never get myself makeup forever stuff so i needed it and the other one was number five obviously they only have numbers they don't ever name their stuff so number five is more of a beigey color then the first one's more of a gold color and if you feel these these are so soft so soft not powdery, absolutely stunning, worth every single cent. So that's number five, and this is number three. You see both of them? Oh, they're just stunning. I cannot wait to use them. So those are the three things that I did not get that were not lip products. So now on to the lips. First thing I picked up, I decided I was debating between this and the NARS Audacious Lipsticks. But because I never own anything NARS as far as lip products, I wanted to try something that had more of a variation. So I picked up the NARS, um, what is this? The NARS Digital World Lip Pencil Core Coffret, Coffret, I think that's what they call it. So it comes with the five, um, I'm just going to toss this, it comes with the five lippies. And let me tell you guys, this packaging is to die for. Look at this, isn't this beautiful? So it comes with the five, no! I caught that guys, I caught that. <laughs> these are the five that it came with. I'm going to swatch these super quick for you guys. So, um, is not to take so long in this video. So the first one is Taurus the Del Plain. It's like this uh, peachy color, this peachy nude, which is right here. Next one is called Descanso, which in Spanish means rest. The next one is called YU, so you, which is this pinky color right here. Orangey color is called Ubricchio, Ubricchio, 
right there. And the last one is Cruella, which is like your nice red color. Now, real quick, if you do own these or you did purchase these, when you pop these out, make sure you stick them and twist the cap on. Because if you just put them on there, it's going to fill up with air and pop off or not actually seal the product all the way. So that's the only downside to these. Just make sure you twist it down. Be careful not to ruin the actual cap or the, the tip of your actual um lip pencil so those are the five colors super pretty i like the variation of the colors i love the packaging so that is the first lippy product that i did pick up the next lip product that i picked up was this bite beauty um high pigment lip pencil quad quad i don't know how you call it the four thing the one that came out with the four now a lot of people say that this is the first year this that this came out Last year they came out with one and it was great and I did pick that up last year before Bite Beauty was even big which I really truly enjoy. I love the packaging. It comes with a, a uh, mirror on there and these are the four lip products that it comes with. I'm not going to swatch these. You guys have seen this all over YouTube but obviously these are the four colors. I love these. These are going to last you forever. And if you do not want to pay $22 for one, this was $25 and you get four to try. So that's the next thing I purchased. And the last things that I did pick up, and I'm going to show you each individual one because I just could not get enough of Bite Beauty and I needed to pick these up, were those little mini... Um, double-ended ones or the matte ones. I basically picked up all the matte ones. I don't own any of the matte line and this was a perfect way. Each of them were $12 minus 20% off so I had to get them. If you wanted to give these away as a gift, it has a little tag that says to and from and you can hang these on a tree. Isn't this super cute? You could actually put this on a basket for somebody. So just an idea. Um, if they're still available, I would check these out. The double-ended one, the only one that I got that was double-ended uh, was the one that had Poppy and, ooh, excuse me, Scarlet. So this is Poppy. Poppy is like your red color. And I am so excited to try Scarlet. Scarlet is like your, ooh, that deep color, like deep vampy color. Kind of matches my nails. Beautiful. So I picked that one up because I did not have any of the dual ones that look like that. I did pick up, let me see, picked up one gloss. Oh, I gotta drop everything. I picked up the one gloss in the color Guava. They had about four of these. I didn't, I wasn't really interested in too many of them, but this is Guava. It's a really nice everyday kind of a lip, lip gloss. So I wanted to try one. I don't own any of the glosses either. So that was a great opportunity to pick that one up. And then I picked up the four matte colors that they did come out with the first one is called what are you called gavi so this is gavi it's a nice neutral everyday kind of peachy color it's really pretty then i picked up glace or glace which is more of a kind of how would i describe this like a very very muted down purple kind of like a um soft per i don't even know how to describe it it's like a weird color but i'm excited to try it i don't own anything like this color at all then the next one is maraschino which is your beautiful holiday red color it's very bright and the last one is called Aubergine, which is, oh, that beautiful purple kind of matches. It's basically the color of my sweater, exactly the color of my sweater. So that's basically what I did get as far as the lip side of the haul. Um, like I said, I did debate about other things. But I placed three separate orders online, plus went to the store, so I thought I had done enough damage. Knowing that Black Friday was coming, knowing that I was going to be spending more money in the holidays, so I kind of kept it to what I knew I wanted to try to um, 
this holiday season. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I told you guys it was going to be super quick. Um, I didn't want to do like a 20 some video and do everything all at once just because I've been giving you guys so, much, so many long videos. I wanted to keep it and tone it down. So that is it what I got for the VIB sale. No more shopping except for today I went shopping I'm pretty sure you'll probably see a haul about today's shopping if you guys did go out today I hope you guys had great sales I hope you were safe and you enjoyed yourself I am probably sitting on the couch half dead once a year mr. man lets me mope around the house without ever asking me a question and that is on Black Friday because he knows I am up for over 24 hours and I don't want to do anything but just sit and watch Christmas movies so and eat leftovers basically so that's what I'll probably be doing while you guys are watching this video thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to comment like and subscribe any other haul videos that I might have up maybe like another two or three maybe I don't know so many stores so many places had so many sales today and Cyber Monday so I'm pretty sure I placed a few orders that are not Christmas like so um, let me know if you guys want to see those hauls if not I'm not even going to show you guys so thank you guys again for watching and don't forget that a smile is the best makeup a girl can wear bye guys